Hey guys, welcome. I'd like to share with you an interview with a very special friend of mine. Rhonda came to me about five years ago having had migraines for over 20 years. After a really successful course of treatment, she became migraine free. I wanted to get with her today and find out how she's doing. I hope that if you have migraine headaches, neck and shoulder pain, any of those symptoms, you'll be really encouraged by the story she has to tell and the journey she's had. I hope you enjoy the interview I had with my friend, Rhonda. What, what happened? Well, I um, actually got hit from the side and it spun the whole car around. And so I guess in the process of spinning everything around, you know, my head was kind of going around at the same time too. And it was back before we had airbags in the front of the car, so. Yeah. Well, basically if I had an episode, I would go into a room by myself, have every light in the room off, pull the covers up over my head, just couldn't eat or drink because it would make me feel sick, like I was gonna throw up. And basically, I have to take, you know, ibuprofen or whatever, or Excedrin migraine or whatever I could take, and then basically pray that I would fall asleep. And then hopefully once I woke up, then the headache would be gone. But now I don't have to do that. I don't have days like that anymore. I honestly thought I was just gonna have them for the rest of my life, because I had had them for over 20 years. But you were willing to take a leap of faith. Yes. Why were you willing to do that? I didn't have anything to lose. I tried medication. It didn't work for me. So it was either not do anything and see the spots or go out on a limb with you mm -hmm. and try the treatment. I find that most people want a pill or a shot. I think we're conditioned that way yeah. in our society. I think everybody thinks that their answer comes in a pill or in a shot. And they don't think that something simple um, could really be the answer to their problem. Now, if I happen to have an episode and I see a spot, I know exactly what to do. I do the tucks, they go away. So how long does it take you to get rid of your symptoms now? Less than a minute. Really? Less than a minute. So how often will you get symptoms now? Once or twice a month, maybe. Really? Mm -hmm. uh, what were your kids say? Did they notice a difference? Oh, yeah. They were like, wow, mom's not having to go to bed all the time. <laughs> And mom can get out and do stuff with us, you know, mm -hmm. it, it just, it, migraines are just debilitating. I mean, they limit your quality of life. Mm -hmm. um, you can't be the person that you want to be because you're bound with this migraine. I mean, if you had one minute to tell somebody who's had a car wreck and has migraines, you know, what would you tell them? Tell them that pills and needles aren't always your answer. If you suffer with migraines and everything you've tried doesn't work, you need to give the physical therapy a shot. It worked for me and it can work for them.